We are all about harnessing the power of the immune system to develop therapeutics for either cancer or autoimmune diseases. When the company was founded, uh, in the immunology part, we were two scientists. Q had a very basic notebook system back at the time, and we understood very quickly that we needed something more powerful for our research if we want to go to the clinic, if we want to be public, if we just want to evolve on the right direction. I've worked in early discovery, I've worked in process development, I've worked in late stage development, CMC. There is a flow of information back and forth. Uh, that should be there. Uh, a lot of times you have the research side basically tossing something over the fence to the development team and then they take it and run with it and it's gone. We really want that information to flow back to our research team so that they can use it and improve the research that they're doing. Benchling allows us to have that flow of information back and forth instead of a unidirectional information exchange. It's a limb system on top of an inventory system, on top of a, um, a notebook system. It's helped us to organize all of this. So if you have your researchers think about how they're collecting data, it's a little bit easier to push things into the development space where you may not have to redo experiments over because it's already been captured by the research group. We can bring on our own process development in-house now. Benchling helped us to, to, ju to just save so much time and energy to ask authorizations to test these molecules in humans. So of course, everything has to be standardized, optimized, and kind of perfect. And Benchling helps uh, that way to have everything set up. We know that everything that is in Benchling, we can trust it. It's helpful to a point where it's like a revolution in our group. <laughs> Most people have had cancer affect someone in their lives at some point. It is nice to be part of a potential solution to a lot of problems. These patients are sick and it's one of their last resorts. And I think having a tool organizing all the behind the scenes um, helped us to go faster.